Hello, in this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to activate Adobe Acrobat Reader plugin for both Firefox and Chrome so that you can get the functionality that the Adobe Reader has instead of just using the um, PDF viewer for each of those browsers. So I'm starting uh, in Google Chrome right here. I'm going to show you how to uh, get to the, the uh, options here. So I'm going to just type in Chrome and then uh, colon, slash, slash, and then plugins. And this goes to my plugins. And we'll scroll down here. And we're, what we're looking for is the Adobe PDF viewer. And notice right now that I have the, uh, the Adobe Reader is disabled right here. So I want to enable the Adobe Reader for it's the Adobe PDF plugin for Firefox and Netscape. And I know what I know that this is Firefox, but they're related to Netscape. And then I want to disable the Chrome viewer. And when I when I disabled, I mean when I enabled the Adobe Reader right here, it automatically enabled this. And I'm going to always allow it right here. And then I'm done. Now I'll be able to use the Adobe Reader in um, Firefox. I mean, sorry, in Chrome. And now I'm going to go over to um, to Firefox. And same thing right here, except the way you do it in Firefox, you go to Tools, and you go to Options, and then make sure you click the Applications tab, and then come down here to where it says uh, where it says Adobe Acrobat Forms. Now there are a couple options right here. You don't want to use Adobe Acrobat Reader because that'll that'll open up Reader outside of the browser. So we're going to make sure we use the Adobe Reader. And um, did you notice the other option that there is a, um, you know, you don't see there. Let me, let me go to it. Let me go down to the PDF viewer because that sees port portable document format. That's one that we're really concerned about. Notice that it has, uh, you can use Adobe Acrobat in Firefox or use Adobe Acrobat. And it looks like I've disabled the um, Acrobat PDF viewer uh, so that you can't use it. But anyways, you want to use Adobe Acrobat in Firefox to play everything. And I always, anything that's PDF right here, like Adobe Acrobat Forms and uh, XML data packages, I just make them all be Acrobat in Firefox. And then you click OK. And then you should be able to do your, um, your work in either browser. I mean, be able to use Adobe Reader within each browser. That's all.